Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining me for today's episode of Spider-Man. That last one, wow. Seriously, a tearjerker went straight to the fields. I cannot believe how quickly I started the game and it went from happy, cracking jokes, bright city, dealing with a couple villains, but usually it's really lighthearted stuff, listening to Peter joke around, going on a date with MJ, investigating the demon mask guys, being suspicious of Martin. Ooh. Ooh, Martin. Being suspicious of that beep, beep, <laughs> beep, beep. Martin decides that he is going to attack the, I think it, there was like a, it was a mayoral campaign thing, but also doubled as the medal ceremony for Miles Morales' dad, Jefferson Davis. I don't know why they have different last names, so if someone could explain that to me, that would be great. Unfortunately, Jeff passes away, sacrificing himself to push the explosive guy away. He passes. <sighs> it was really, really sad. I am shocked that Miles is in this game. I didn't obviously think that he would be. The movies, they're in completely different universes. I didn't know if that's how the games would be, but I definitely did not expect a Miles cameo. But here we are, there was a funeral, and now I don't know what we're doing next. Hopefully we're tracking down Martin, give him the one to knock him out. I'm going to refrain from ranting about him anymore because I it could probably go on for hours. So let's jump into the game. Friends, today we have a very special caller, breaking important news right here, because where else? Mayor Osborne, thanks for calling in. No, thank you, Jonah. When you were publishing the Bugle, you were always fair to me. Tough, sure, but fair. Well, that's my job, Mr. Mayor. All I have is my integrity, and I won't compromise it for anyone. Now, what's this crucial breaking news you're revealing for the first time anywhere on my show? Well, after the brutal, cowardly city hall bombing that almost claimed my life, it's clear our understaffed police department needs help. And I want to reassure the people of New York that I am providing it. Aha! I said it! You all heard me say we needed this. Are you using my idea of bringing in cops from Lake Placid? Ah, no. Though that was a fine idea. No, this would be a security contractor, much like the ones our military uses to assist our troops overseas. I can't name it until the contracts are signed, but their qualifications are impeccable. Well, that sounds terrific, Mr. Mayor. Though, of course, I'll have to reserve my tough but fair final judgment until I have all the facts. <gasps> wow! I'd expect nothing less. And let me oh, that was so cool. This is in no way replacing our brave officers of the law, just augmenting them in a way that augmenting cuts through them. the red tape and gets results. And results are what we want. Again. You know, I'm glad you're here. So I can share my theory on how Spider-Man may well be working with the demons. <laughs> and a fascinating theory it is, I'm sure. Oh, that's but my so cool. doctors are advising me to get some rest now, so if you don't mind. Oh, of course. Thank you for calling in, Mr. Mayor. My lines are open for you anytime. Jared, did you hear? Tough, but fair! That's our new slogan. I don't care who else is using it. Don't care. So that brings me to a thought that I had and I forgot to say. Interesting how the mayor just took off, not alerting anyone when he could have said it and people could have started running and trying to disperse. Shocker. Last one. Amazing coverage. Can you hear me now? <laughs> Uh, what what is that Verizon commercial? I do like this suit. I just wish it had the reactive eyes. Let's look. Does it have new ones? I don't like that one at all. I'm not gonna elaborate on why. I just don't like it. Let's see. I think someone requested that I try out the 
Classic suit repaired. Yeah, that one looks really nice. I think it was hybrid? Which one's the hybrid one? It was this. No associated power, though. I just feel like gold doesn't fit Spider-Man very well. And that's that. Every crime tower in the city is now repaired. Pretty good work, right? Pretty good, yeah. Good enough that maybe you'd let a certain someone celebrate with us? <sighs> Fine, but make it quick. The odds were long, the danger close. But between Spider Cop's no. reckless intuition and the Chief's determined planning, they got the job done. Aw, that's kind of sweet. A pairing of opposites, like peanut butter and chocolate, or breakfast for dinner. The two work together. And we're done. Talk to you later, Spider Cop. She's coming around, right? Oh. Yeah, definitely. I thought he fell off the building. I'm like, did he really just scale up the dang building? <laughs> really? Brutes take too far as a focus to defeat with a finisher. Okay. Oh, dang it. There we go. I love that they get webbed to the building. That's such a nice touch. Okay. Man, there's so much crime. Took a bullet from the cops back when they thought I was working with Electro. Good thing textbooks are thick. Too bad they're also expensive. Oh, it went through. Whoa. Took a bullet. The menu from my first real date with MJ. Wish I could have afforded someplace fancier. But she didn't seem to mind. Looks fancy to me. All I did was save this kid's balloon from floating away, and he made me this. Aw. It's the little things that make it all worth it. That's sweet. Spider plushie! Oh, a toy designer made this prototype to get me to license my likeness. Too bad there's no way to get paid without revealing my identity. I could never give you can't this send prototype it to like spider a tracer an anonymous account. useful. But I did adapt the tech into my web traps, which really come in handy. I feel like there has to be a solution to that. We listened to that one, we listened to that one, we listened to that one. Um, we've listened to everything. Okay. Now I know to listen to all of them. Thank you guys for telling me. Okay, do this, and then let's take off to the main quest. Another camera. Gotta be Black Cat. Are you jealous I'm visiting my other man? I hope so. But you should know, bad boys aren't my type. Oh, man. Uh, Peter, you got something you want to tell us? Now's the time. Jeez. Oh, ma- I've been here for longer than I would ever want to admit. Where is it? Why are you doing this, Felicia? You know I'm gonna catch you. Her face was right there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is it like that every time? I cannot believe I didn't... Was her face there before? Or did it appear after? It had to have been there before. As I just I missed warned, it. Nostradamus -like. After Spider-Man recklessly took down Wilson Fisk without preparing for the consequences. Hush. MJ's hunch was right. Place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around. Okay. Get to test my stealth skills. Anything I can shoot? Yeah, go look at that. Both of you. One of you. Oh, man. <gasps> Perfect.
Okay, no one else back here. Oh, oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Movement is bad right now. Someone know much, you. Oh, we're not. There is no way we're stealth taking him down. There is no shot. Let me take the other guy out before I even attempt it. No way, no way. See the last one? Um, try that. Oh, really? Wow. I figured that wouldn't have worked. Nice. Okay, that's all of them. <sighs> High security lock. They use these on banks, not recycling centers. Are we gonna... Maybe if I can find where it gets its power from. Oh, yeah, yeah. Looks like I could override the circuit. Need my electric webs. Well, that did something. It looks like the circuits need a little more juice. So over here, maybe? There. Looks like the circuit's still stable. Maybe there's another junction box close by. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. One more. Gotcha. Almost there. One more box should do it. Oh, there's another. Right here? Uh huh. That's it. There's going to be so many of them inside. That's just my guess. I feel like that stealth wasn't so bad, so maybe, maybe I can handle it. Just maybe. Okay, wait, why did I jump backwards just then? What's up with that? Is that what happens if you hold down L1, R1? Must be where they're planning to attack. Wait, these are Osborne campaign offices. All the paths originate from the same address. Okay, so Osborne had to have done something to Martin, right? There's something going on like that. Lots of high tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. Wait, maybe it's Oscorp related? It's possible. Because he's not just the mayor. Guns from Fisk's armory. Truck bombs? This is crazy. Wow. He's trying to destroy the whole city. Explosives from Fisk's construction site. This wasn't a gang war. The demons were stealing from Fisk to go after Mayor Osborne. Did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of beef with Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. Okay. Be careful. Let's go. Yuri, it's me. Make it quick. I'm busy getting yelled at by my boss. 
Martin Lee and the demons are planning another attack, this time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. Are you sure? We've had a lot of false leads in the past week. Trust me on this one. I'm sending you the address of a recycling center. You'll find all the evidence there. Got it. I'll get those campaign offices evacuated. But if you're wrong about this, you're gonna help me find a new job. Oh, lose the attitude. Oh my god, that's so cool! I love when it transitions into that. Consolidated oh. shipping. Sniper galore. A lot of guys. I should try to do this quietly, but also with style. Okay, so take out the snipers first. Definitely. Where are they at? Open the gadget page. I can use that stuff I found at the recycling center. Grab the trip mine. Nice. Love using bad guys own weapons against them. Hold L2 to aim trip mines on the boxes. Oh, these boxes? Oh, I see. And that, my friends, is what karmic justice looks like. Okay, wait. Where are the snipers at? Because we saw them. I literally didn't see that coming. No. Oh my gosh. Do not get detected. Oh, sniper's way over there. Is the other guy? Right there? Okay, wait. Trip mine? Will he walk into that? I think I threw it too far. Dang it. Yeah, I think I did. No one's gonna walk into that. I would probably walk into it before they did. Uh -huh. Oh my god, I forgot you can kick boxes. Oh, man. Man, man, man. Wait, no, no, that's good. That's good, because look. The other one was distracted. We came in for the metaphorical kill, not actual kill. Okay. Mm, maybe from over here I can do it. Shh. Oh, I like that. <laughs> Hush. Go to sleep. Okay, two snipers. All right. Good to know. I, I gotta be quick with the movement. Okay, that guy's coming back to me, actually. Let me just wait. We have him. Four at the bot. Nope. Four, five, six at the bottom, two snipers. Huh? Sweet dreams. I swear, if I run into that box right now, I'm deleting my YouTube channel. Oh, thank goodness. The amount of times I've ran <laughs> I know you guys have seen it. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna take him down and then I'm like doo -doo -doo -doo, stomping through. Breaking everything in my path. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Nice. Okay, and then I have a plan. I'm going to trip mine right there and then I'm going to regular just whoa look guys there's something crazy over there hurry go check it out hurry <laughs> do you guys see that okay well that was just one I wanted to get like four wait do I have another I do I do Watch this. 
Hey. Did you hear that? Alright, go look at it. There's something dangerous. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Where did he come from? <laughs> what? Nighty night. Did he just walk right past me? Didn't care? We just have... Oh yeah, yeah. Let's go get this guy. Definitely. Let's go get this guy. He said danger. I heard that. They don't know what kind of danger though, do they? Yeah. The danger is in the fence. <laughs> oh, these guys. Looking through the fence that doesn't even have holes. It's covered by some sort of tarp. That's good. Okay. Go over there. Take him out. No snoring now. Bam. Go over there. Take him out. Bam. You guys. Did Martin train you guys? Is that what this is? He's not Ooh. out here. Better I bet check he did. Inside. I bet that this was Martin's doing. You can't blame you guys, because if Martin trained you, then... It was subpar, at best. <laughs> Good thing I stopped this when I did. Uh, you could blow up half of Manhattan with this stockpile. Yep. The Martin slander will not stop. I'm sorry. Huh. Invoice from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune-up. Whoa! What else can I find around here? 1.8 million? 180,000 for galaxy tires. <laughs> Hardened vehicle armor, 350,000 for 24. Oh my goodness. Wow. Not the labor being 700. <laughs> I believe that. I believe that. No, 800,000. Mechanics have to get paid. I believe that. They have bases all around the city. Complete demon warehouses around the city to earn base tokens, okay? You may filter any of the map icons on the legend page, which can be accessed by pressing triangle, okay? Oh. Okay. So you can focus on uh, like one or two things at a time. Won't be so overwhelming. That's cool. This is bigger than I thought. Looks like the demons have an army. Oh. As if one deadly glowing whip wasn't enough. Expecting, but it was definitely not this. He was trained, Rod Martin. Come on. You can tell. Oh, hey, well, he wasn't. <laughs> I think I stopped the demon's attack on Osborne's campaign offices. Nice. Did you find Lee? No, but I found something we should look into. A place called Pale Horse Rides. Uh, sounds familiar. I'll check it out and get back to you. Oh, man. Trying to get the electricity one out. This and then triangle. Or I unlock something new. Yeah. 
I love the finishers. Oh, let's see. Okay, so the guys with like tools and stuff, I keep forgetting I need to uppercut them, right? That's the trick with them. Is this a military group? Safety's off. Well, this is new. The security, whatever, no, no, private no. security. This one's mine. All right. I'm executing this son of a. Hey! That's not how we do things. Down. Down. Code SM1. Whoa, whoa. Before <gasps> we do this, who the hell are you guys? Code SM1. Code SM1. Holding for orders. Code Spider-Man 1. Copy code SM1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverbird. Who is that? Okay, so she's not a friendly. Nice entrance. Solid 8 out of 10. Mm, seven. <laughs> seven because I'm a hater. Nine out of ten. Release him. He works with us. Yep. Milita military, whatever security group. Your wow. Explanation, please. This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International. A private security force. Private security, not Paid military. Paid for by Mayor Osborne. Of course. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now? Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. This girl. Will Spider-Man fight a girl? He better. Sorry about that Sable thing. I should have told you earlier, but it all happened so fast. It's okay. We're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took <laughs> a dark turn. Anyway, Sable has the mayor's oh. ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin Lee. I'm working on that. Hey, MJ. Hey, so I dredged up some records on Martin Lee's other business holdings. He's got places all over the city. Huh. The locations line up with a map I found at that shipping business. I'll check them out. Let me know what you find at each one, and I'll work on building a case. You got it. I'm headed to Lee's office at Feast to see if I can learn more about why he's doing this. And what he's got planned next. Okay. Say hi to May for me. Wait, you don't think she's in danger, do you? No. Lee's only got one target on his mind. Norman Osborne. Well... Not the only person that got hurt, though. I wonder if we see him as being Peter. Peter. So if you're he obviously doesn't know Peter Spider-Man. Who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. 
Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No, why? I'm just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. He's like, oh, he's such a sweet boy. <laughs> I should check out Lee's office. I like the way he worded it better than how MJ worded it. He's like, he should stay busy. MJ was like, I think he needs a job. <laughs> I know she meant well, though. I'm just rolling, but I thought it was funny. It's like, maybe he needs a friend. No, maybe he needs someone who knows what he's going through. No, he needs a job. <laughs> I just tried to L2 R2 to the railing multiple times confused why it wasn't working um because i'm in peter form that's why i'm trying to get myself exposed i heard the deputy mayor is ex is brainwashed okay what kind of clues can we find here in martin's office hmm. this office is locked how do i get in there thanks i appreciate it how to get in are we doing it? Make sure no one's looking. Maybe there's a vent somewhere. Oh, so when he wants to do it, okay. Huh. Never seen that room before. Oh. Let's go in. Watching him do this in his everyday clothes is a little uncomfortable. <laughs> Just a tiny bit. Oh, we can't drop down? Oh, I'm supposed to continue. Whoa, what the? There. High voltage lines. What needs this much power? I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. Account number. Something hasn't been paid. Might want to close the blinds. No? Okay. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. Ooh, who is this? Is that Martin and his wife, perhaps? Maybe she died and, and um... Lee's parents. Oh, that's his parents. Looks like there's oh. a keyhole in the frame. I thought Lee's parents abandoned him. Why build a shrine to the people who threw you away? And how is Herman involved with this? Oh, wait. Supposed to look around, yeah. Oh, I gotta find the key, of course. Dear May, very soon you'll hear stories about me. Stories claiming I'm a terrorist Looks and a like murderer. This for May. Those stories will be true. But the story we wrote together, the story of Feast, is also true. I want you to know that I always believed in our mission. I wasn't you a really did care about May. It wasn't a front or a show. She's out of danger. It was an honest expression of my heart. When you help someone, you truly do help everyone. Please don't let my friends. Oh, wait, man, his handwriting. Please don't let my failings share your. Oh, okay. I... Please don't let my failings shake your belief. You're strong, May. Strong enough to tell us and tell a new story at feast. One unburdened by my faults. Thank you for all you've done, Martin. Is he leaving her with Feast? Huh. The shrine in the photo is missing the picture. It is. Okay. Must be a key somewhere in this office. Lee's journal. Bet this fits the lock in the portrait. Oh, man. 
Wilson Fisk has been arrested. I can barely believe it. The day I've planned for, dreamed of, is finally here. For some reason, I hesitate. Can I really go through with this? Things will happen so quickly if I Lee give the word. He sounds conflicted. Almost my, like he didn't want to head down this path. My men will claim Fisk's arms, his explosives, his secrets. will use that strength to teach Norman true pain. He'll know what it is to see the things he loves destroyed by his own hands. But achieving that end will mean giving up so much. Everything I built here at Feast, all the good I've done, could be wiped out if my plan succeeds. My chance is finally here, yet still I hesitate. Should I turn back? A part of me wants to, but the demon is hungry, and I don't think I'm strong enough to hold it back. Oh, wow. The demon. Does that mean he's being, like, possessed and he feels like he can't control it? I guess we'll see. Some kind of puzzle lock. That seems right. Oh, I see. What are you hiding, Lee? I hope we're about to find out. What is- how? How is that possible? He's giving his powers to the others. What is it? How does Lee imbue these with his power? Yeah. Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? Oh my god, Peter's so smart. Creepy. Very creepy. Can feel my power growing, feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance that he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. What? Logical? Can feel my power. Just that? This is all about Norman Osborne. Yeah. His whole career. Well, he must have been obsessed with him. But why? This article is decades old. It must be back when Oscorp was first founded. The kids Oscorp saved. Oscorp announces new scholarship award winner. Oscorp lost a lawsuit about improper clinical trials years ago. Did they cover this up? I've never heard of it. Lee was keeping tabs on Wilson Fisk, too. Trying to predict when he'd fall. This is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Is that it? Phew. It's a burn room, wired to destroy evidence. Oh man. Okay, how do we get out? Right here? Oh. Duh. He's Spider-Man. No? One more. Oh, there it is. The police had found this. Or May. I want to think of what could have happened. Hmm. 
Now, how do I get out of here? I wonder if he left the place Hello, to... Oh! Oh! I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. Get that. Thank you. And uh, heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. Oh my goodness. Okay, so... Does he suspect Peter of being Spider-Man? Or does he just suspect Peter of being onto him? Wow. Wait, wait, wait! Wait, are these just regular people? Yep, I think they are. I cannot stand him. Truly, I can't stand him. Captain Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named May Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that. But I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A yeah. substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. Wait, it was created by Oscorp? MJ, hey, just checking in. Peter, hey, can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool, see ya. Wait, okay. remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? <sighs> what should I cook? <gasps> Wait, are we gonna get to see that? I hope so. Okay, so I gave this suit a chance. It's not my favorite, so we're gonna switch off of it. Wait, I have a new one. <laughs> oh man. If I had. Wait, I do have enough. <laughs> No, I can't. You guys will cuss me out. I can't. Let's do the classic suit for a little while. Classic suit repaired. Because I love those eyes. If the, um, this one, if this one, if there was a variation of this one with the eyes, oh yeah, I'd be all over it. But there's not currently. Maybe later. Okay. Oh, hi, doctor. How are you? Parker, exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like now? Oh, goodness. This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. He's telling cool. us his plan. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. No. Uh, okay. Be right no. there. Peter. No. Peter. No. This means I have a job again. Yes, I can stop by. Just for a minute. Oh, my goodness. We're going to miss dinner, aren't we? I can already see where this is going. Oh man, oh man. 
All right, let's see if I can keep the speed up the whole time. Let me focus. Missed another call from Doc. Peter, I wanted to make sure you're still available. I can't pay you yet, but I've pulled enough strings to keep the wolves from the door a bit longer. If we can get up and running, I know this new version of the project will attract investment. Massive investment. Stay ready. Fingers triple crossed, Doc. You guys. It's getting away. Oh my goodness. Please hype me up in the comments. Please. Please! <laughs> this pigeon knows the city better than I do. You guys have to admit that was pretty good. That was not bad. Okay. Okay, that was bad. No comment on that. Hey, I got a pick up some speed, pick up some speed. These birds are vicious. I was trying to aim up. Okay, we can't win them all. I did good on the way over. Taking me home, buddy. Okay, perfect. I don't know, now that I'm looking at all the suits, the one that the game came with, the one that I had with the white spider, kind of looks the coolest to me. I think the white grew on me, I'm gonna have to put it back. We'll see. I wanna unlock some more. Hey doctor. I bet there's Hello, a bunch Peter. of cool ones. I'll be just a minute. Okay. Look at wow. Otto's activity. Look at all this new stuff. How did he get this? Cuz I didn't get a paycheck. Wait a second. Hold the phone. My Friday paycheck never came and there's a bunch of boxes. I have questions. Parker. We've been focused on limb replacement. Connecting I feel like I listened to this, but the message Parker. might be different, so. We've been focused on limb replacement. Connecting nerves at severed extremities, replicating the function of lost appendages. But what if instead, we gave people something they've never seen? Something straight from the mind. Unchain all of us from the bodies we've been born with, and instead, unleash the awesome power of our minds. Okay, I definitely don't think I listened to that. Unleash the awesome power of our minds. What in the world is Otto been doing? Damn it! Why do I keep repeating the same mistake over and over? Norman Osborne cannot be trusted. In matters large and small, if Norman has the chance to profit off another man's loss, he'll take it. It's infuriating. Mm -hmm. Someday yeah. I'll turn the tables. I'll teach Norman what it is to feel helpless and small. Doc must have more history with Norman than he shared. Wait, I should check out the bios. Wonder if it says... Otto has been my childhood idol since I was six years old. Other kids would l talk about Captain America or Iron Man, but I dreamed of growing up to be like Otto Octavius. Aunt May was the one who called and got me the summer internship with him. He didn't even have any... In he didn't even have an intern program. He just hired me based on May's word. Two years later, I'm working for him full time and we're on the brink of something that's going to change the world. I just wish six year old me could see me now. Genius level intellect, able to think around even the most complex problem. Genius level intellect, able to think around even the most complex problems to devise elegant, effective solutions. Hmm. Let's read this one. Norman Osborne, my best friend's dad, the founder of the world's biggest tech company and now the mayor of New York. It's hard not to admire the guy, or it would be if he wasn't arrogant, condescending, and generally dishonest. Still, I can't bring myself to ever hate Harry's dad. Nobody who raised Harry could ever be all bad. Vast wealth and unmatched political gamesmanship. Terrorist. Okay, we gotta read this. Martin Lee has an alter ego. Jonah's been calling him Mr. Negative on his show. Jonah always did have an ear for branding. Mr. Negative is like the inverse of Martin Lee, but with some kind of crazy energy powers. I'd love to know how the energy works, but I'm not ready to die to find out. Real question is, what's happening to Martin Lee? Did he plan the whole attack on City Hall, or is Mr. Negative some kind of weird alternate personality what's driving his rage? Powers and abilities can generate and control a highly destructive negative energy, able to corrupt people, 
effectively mind controlling them with just a touch increased strength and speed able to give small portions of his powers to his followers when did they call him mr negative i don't remember hearing that silver Sab sablanova aka silver sable is not what pops into your head when you think of a princess but that's what she is her father ernst is king of the eastern european nation of Simcaria. They're hardly your typical pampered royal family, though. Silver's grandfather fought the Nazi occupation personally, leading a resistance that was never defeated. After the war, the country's primary resource was trained, hardened soldiers, so he found Sable International, a paramilitary force available to the highest bidder. Silver's brought them into 21st century in both tech and tactics. Nowadays, Sable International's agents come from all over the world, but Silver Sable is their unquestioned leader and finest soldier. Trained from early childhood by the greatest warriors in the world, she just might be the best pure fighter I've ever seen. I can understand why Mayor Osborne hired Sable Security to fortify a police department left shorthanded by the arrest of all the cops on Wilson Fisk's payroll, but the police are there to protect and serve the public. Sable Security is there to serve Osborne, and from what I've seen of Silver, she's not one to exercise restraint. This is Manhattan, not a war zone. I don't think she's a bad person, just hardened by life and her job. But even though I'm not crazy about her methods, I can't deny she's put her life on the line to take down some really bad guys since she's been here. As long as she's running Sable Security, we should be okay, I hope. Powers and Abilities, Extraordinary Hand-to-Hand -hand com com Combatant. Powers and Abilities, Extraordinary Hand-to-Hand -hand Combatant. A martial artist, expert marksman, accomplished gymnast, fluent in multiple languages. Oh, Miles. I can't stop replaying the event in my head. If I had just reacted a second earlier, if there's some clue I missed at the construction site, if, 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 Jeff would still be alive and Miles would still have a father. I owe it to Jeff to find some way to help Miles. I don't know how to do it yet, but I have to honor his father's memory. An intuitive grasp of science and technology. Man. Oh wait, we're not even, oh yeah, yeah. We really need this. to get better about it. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. Okay. Wait, what was this? Our first volunteer subject. Lance Corporal Texador. Lost his arm overseas and now just wants to hug his daughter again. Aw. That's sweet. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. Okay. You ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a- No, Otto. Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. Peter! I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> he acknowledges they're bad. That's the first step. Uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. I would love to know what happened between him and Norman. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add corp to that and, well, it is a catchy name. 
Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. It'll work. I believe. We have to fix it? Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Okay. Huh. No good. Gotta reroute this circuit. Incorrect voltage. So I can't pick those up. Okay, so let me think. What can I do here? That just took every ounce of brain power I had. That was hard. Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? What's wrong with his arm? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. Sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. Lord forbid that loan included a little bit for Peter. Exit the lab. From MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. All right, you guys, I think that that concludes part four to this playthrough. I feel like I got a lot done, especially since I unlocked the entire map. That took me a minute to do because I kept getting interrupted by the crime stuff. I'm glad that we ran into Martin, but I still have so many questions. I assume that somehow Martin is related to this lawsuit that... Otto left the company about and it was covered up. We don't really know anything about it yet, but I would assume somehow Martin is involved with that. Norman is just the biggest piece of crap. He doesn't seem like a person that's trustworthy, a person that you would want to be friends with. I know Peter said that he's a good dad to Harry, but or that he couldn't be so bad if he raised Harry. But even when I was doing the research stuff, and Harry was talking about them wanting to shut down his mother's research labs. That doesn't sound like a great person to me. I can't wait to continue so that we can find out more about Martin. I'm hoping that the Silver Sable girl has a little bit more involvement somehow. She seems like a cool character even though she kind of came in and immediately wanted to kill Peter. I tried my best to incorporate some of the tips you guys gave me on part one and part two. So thank you for that. I feel like my swinging around has definitely improved. Definitely a work in progress still but... Made some improvements, need to work on the combat, but that's what the playthrough is for. Slowly improve as I go, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you for the next part. Bye, guys.